I'll be on some other shit It's kind of bittersweet that I fell in love with it I always felt that if I always cared about how I dress That folks would think I'm arrogant and chicks would lose interest But as it turns out, people start to notice you more You turn heads when you step in foot in the sneaker store Like where you get them, can I get them, what's the biggest size left And chicks I never would have seen What's up everybody, it's Big Rob TV And I'm back with round 12 of the Jordan versus LeBron sneaker battle, all right? Now, look, y'all, I have struggled with round 12. I have struggled. I, I have literally been sitting in this room staring at these shoes. Then I look around the room and I see other variations of said shoes and I um man this I think this has been the hardest one I think this I know I went back and forth it's something about the two it's something about you know round two I struggled and I wound up changing my original pick and with round 12 man 10 10 rounds later here I am again struggling and I know that's shocking. I know the hype. I know everybody watching here has already clicked on this video and instantly said, oh, that's an easy win for the Jordan Jordan 12s. Easy. Easy win. No big deal, right? The more I sit and I think about it and the more I, I hold each shoe, it becomes harder for me. But let's get into this. Can, can, I, can I have a tie? Can I have a tie? Is it? <sighs> Let's get into the first contestant, man. Boom. Jordan 12, baby. Whoo, French blues on them. Whoo. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Had to have these. Had to have these. These came out when I was at WrestleMania with the homies down in Dallas, Texas. Very dope shoe, man. Glad I was able to get these. Fun fact, with the exception of one pair of the five, is it six? One, two, three, four, five, six. I have six pairs of Jordan 12s, all right? With the exception of one, which is the CP3 Jordan 12, which is green and gold. Those are my high school colors. With the exception of that one pair, every Jordan 12 that I have is a variation of blue to some degree. It's, it's a blue Jordan 12. So I don't have playoffs. I don't have taxis. I don't have breads. I don't have any of that. I have nothing but blues for the most part. All right. So if you were expecting to see some playoffs or some taxis or some cherries or whatever, you're not going to see that. You will never see that on this channel. So just, just a heads up. But, man, this one's dope. If I had to pick, this is probably my favorite 12. This is it right here, man. Very dope shoe. Very dope shoe. Got your red jump man on the inside there. If you all can see that, hopefully you all can see that. White and blue, red stitching, red on the two, three on the back, red stitching around. Silver eyelets there, and you got your, what was it, your two, three written down there with the jump man. Very nice, very nice material, soft, well not soft down here, but soft tongue, soft around the collar area, lots of cushion in this shoe there not bad all right now for this one i'm going to show both but only because this is a special one the bron game these are the what the lebron 12s all right you see all the different designs around the shoe variations of different LeBron 12s or variations of different LeBrons throughout the years. You know what I mean? Look on the inside. Just dope, man. A lot of nice hits there. 
same on the 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 left shoe very nice lots of nice hits here lots of great details in here man look at the pods on the bottom white bottom it's not the same for all of them there's a lot of different colors but ooh, nice griffy touch dunk man and then that griffy very dope the griffy dunk man i should say but man which one is the winner which shoe is the winner the lebron 12 or the jordan 12 all right man jordan 12 lebron 12 when i tell you all this is this is man this is hard man like i have a winner picked on my phone i have the the winner that i decided weeks ago when i started this whole series when i started planning this out i picked a winner a clear-cut winner but man i have been thinking about this for the last few weeks and i just whoo man this has been a hard one this this is I, I really I'm I'm struggling it there has to be a winner there has to be a winner it cannot be a tie and for that reason man I'm gonna give the win to the LeBron 12 all right I know upset victory I know people are losing their shit right now <laughs> uh, I, I'm, one has to win LeBron 12 takes the W in this round I, I, I know I struggled with this myself originally the LeBron 12 was not the winner the Jordan 12 was the winner it was a clear cut W I didn't even think about it it was just Jordan 12 won but over the last few weeks I've just I just thought about it, man, and I I said, man, you actually like the LeBron 12. Like, you have the high tops, you have the low tops. Like, you really like the the LeBron 12. And I just couldn't I just couldn't give a clear cut W to the Jordan I, I couldn't do it I couldn't do it man like here's another thing that swayed me to the LeBron's all right now I've gotten rid of a pair or two of the LeBron's but I still have six to eight pairs of this shoe right and different variations but I've asked myself recently because I've been considering getting rid of a lot of the shoes that you see behind me and like minimizing my collection. And as I start to think about the shoes that could go, I've asked myself multiple times, Roth, could you get rid of the, the Jordan 12s? Like, would you miss them if they were gone? And I say, nah, you can't get rid of your 12s, no. You just got those blue games that are up there. You just you just recently got those. You can't get rid of those. And then I asked myself, Rob, you sure, man? Like, you don't really rock 12s like that. You don't really rock the Jordan 12s like that. And the pairs that I do wear are the Obsidians. These Obsidians here. The Obsidians and these... French blues. These are the main two that I wear. The others are sitting up there chilling in the box. But as it relates to these LeBrons, as you can see, these are dirty. These the bottoms are dirty. I have other pairs. Those were used for basketball. Those red and white ones there. I have the. I have some other ones here. Let me show you the ones that actually match this shirt. Here's the Meridian ones that that match this shirt. 
Like I actually look, look, dirty bottoms. Like I actually wear my LeBron 12s. Like I really, I really get busy. I wear them out. And usually, if I had to pick between a shoe, if I'm getting dressed, I'm like, man, I'm about to ride out for the day. Let me go grab a shoe. I'm usually, if I'm picking between LeBron 11s and Jordan 11s, I'm usually grabbing the LeBron 11. I, I, I know, I know, I know, man. Shocking victory is not the one that I originally planned. I, I know. I get it. I get it. Leave your your mean comments below. I understand. This is rigged. This is all set up for LeBron to win. <laughs> I know. I get it. But uh, I'm sticking with the decision. I'm not going to change back. I'm sticking with this decision. LeBron, 12. Wins round 12. The series is tied 6-6 six to six after 12 rounds. What do you want me to do, man? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's not going to stay tied forever. We're not going back and forth. I, I, I just couldn't do it, man. I, I guess I just really like the LeBron 12 more. And I'm... Um, Maybe not in the looks. Maybe not like... I like this shoe head to head with this one. I like this one better. I do like the French blue better than the... What the... This is a special kind of LeBron. I get that. But overall of the silhouette and which one do I prefer to wear? I, I prefer to wear the LeBron. This... Look how... I've barely worn this shoe. You can tell, right? It kind of just sits there. So, definitely more wearable. It's just, whatever, man. LeBron, LeBron 12 wins. That's, that's it. That's, that's the story. I struggled. I struggled with this. I know a lot of you are gonna, are gonna give me hell for that, but LeBron 12. So, that's going to do it for this video. Thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe if you have not already. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for subscribing if you have done that. More content is on the way. Leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. Am I tripping? Is this blasphemy? Should the, the Jordan have won? Let me know what you think. And I'll holler at you all in the next video. Peace.